Ahlan wa sahlan. In this video, we're going to work on connecting letters in words. Um, as you know, each letter in Arabic has an independent form and also, also an initial, medial, and final form, depending on its position in the word. Uh, that can seem like a lot of memorization, but it's important to remember as we learn these letters that often there are groups that you can memorize all at once that will make the process of retention a little bit easier. For example, ba, ta, and tha all follow exactly the same pattern of usage. The only difference is the dots that go above the tooth of the letter. Same thing with jim, ha, and kha, dal, and dal. Ra and za, you have these groups, these pairs or trios. So allow that to be a memorization aid. So now as an exercise, let's practice connecting some letters into words. Here we have ba, alif, ba, and we're going to, to connect them to form one word. We're going to take ba and start with the initial form. Notice that it follows into the next letter. And here we have alif, so we're going to use the medial form, and we notice that it doesn't connect with the letter that follows it. We're going to have to start over from the beginning. And here we have a final ba, but since it can't connect with the alif, we're going to use its standalone form. Or the word bab, which means door in Arabic. Uh, another slightly longer example. Dal, jim. Alif, Jim. So we're going to start with Dal, and we notice that Dal's initial form also doesn't connect. It's an unfriendly letter. Standalone Dal. So we're going to start with the initial form of Jim here, even though it's in the middle of the word because it can't connect with Dal. Jim connects to Alif which, as we saw before, doesn't connect with the letter that follows. So once again, we use the standalone form of jim. Dajaj, which means chicken in Arabic. Here's one that's a little longer. Ba, ya, ba, ya. So we start with the initial form of ha. Connect it to the medial form of ba. And here we're going to have kind of a string of medial forms in the word. They all connect. Medial form of ya. Another ba. And final form of ya. Notice the difference between the medial form of ya and the final form of ya. They're a bit different in this ya. The final form is lower. Habibi, which means my darling, my baby, my beloved in Arabic. Here's another. Wow, za, ya, ra. Initial form of wow, which once again is an unfriendly letter, doesn't quite connect with the letters that follow it, so it has a standalone form pretty much by itself. Wow, za, which as we see here in its medial form also doesn't connect. Ya, ra, wazir, which means uh, secretary or minister in the governmental sense. How about another? Mim, ra, ya, bald, mim in initial form. Oh. Mim connects to ra, ya, bald. Marid, which means sick. Finally, Tha, Alif, Ba, Ta. 
initial form of the connects the alif medial form ba and then final ta which we notice has two teeth not one or the word thabit which means stable in arabic <laughs>